Hello everyone, welcome to another video. In this video, I will show you how to add LUTs to Premiere Pro the right way. Now, a lot of tutorials out there don't actually show you the way to manage and add your LUTs in a more simple way. So basically, what you will need to do is you will need to visit your folder where you have Adobe uh, program installed. Now, as you can see right here, if I uh, just scroll in just for you to see, uh, you can see that we have Adobe Premiere Pro 2020. Now, uh, you know, usually what you would do, you would click on Adobe Premiere Pro 2020 and you would basically go and try to find the, the plugins, the LUTs and stuff like that. But as you can see, what Adobe actually does, it, it creates a common folder. So common folder is used. Uh, let's say you are using Adobe Premiere Pro 2020 version and you just installed 2022 version. So if you want the LUTs to appear in 2022 version, you actually need to update the common file right here. Now, if you don't have the common file, you can go to the common file or you can create a common file within uh, this folder. So just go to the C drive, program files, Adobe, and here create a common file uh, right here. Once you go to the common file, for some of you, the common file will exist uh, just like it, exi it existed for me but go to common and then here, as you can see, you have LUTs and plugins. If you don't have the LUTs, but if you see plugins, then make sure to go in and create a LUTs folder here. And in the LUTs folder, create creative and technical LUTs folder. Now here, make sure to go into the creative or technical and add your LUTs right here. Now, once you add your LUTs right here, you'll be able to go to your, uh, you know, to your Premiere Pro, obviously go to window and make sure that the, the LUTs, uh, the Lumetri color and Lumetri scopes are uh, enabled. And then you'll be able to go and use your LUTs right here. So that's basically how you can add LUTs to Premiere Pro and how you can update your LUTs folder if you don't, uh, you know, have it set it up correctly. So. Thank you guys for watching and we'll see you in the next video.